It has been a day of action across the country as supporters of abortion rights took to the streets. Yeah, this was the scene today in New York, Chicago, and Los Angeles. Thousands of women and men showed their opposition to the leaked Supreme Court opinion that would overturn Roe v. Wade. Now, if that happens, about half the states are expected to move quickly to ban abortion outright. Now, while California is not one of those states, marchers still gathered in the heart of downtown. You can see the video here. They did this to show their solidarity. CBS 8's Ariana Cohn was there and has the story. I followed along as hundreds of people marched to support the right for women to choose. Abortion is worth fighting for. Hundreds of bans off our bodies abortion rights supporters are holding demonstrations all over the country, including right here in downtown San Diego. A coalition of progressive and reproductive rights groups, including local Planned Parenthood chapters and Women's March San Diego, walked a little over one mile protesting in response to a leaked draft opinion by the Supreme Court that showed the high court is poised to overturn Roe v. Wade, a 1973 ruling affirming abortion access as a constitutional right. In the 1960s, I had friends who were getting abortions with clothes hangers. If you couldn't find an abortion and the same issues, the rape and the teen pregnancies were happening then. Didn't happen to me, but my friends did, and we were fighting for this then. It just, this is ridiculous that we have to keep going in this circle. Every human being should be able to dictate their own autonomy. Counter protesters were also out today. At one point, things got heated between pro life supporters and pro choice advocates. Abortion rights should be human rights, um, and we believe that, you know, the Democrats could have done a lot more to help uh, protect this very crucial health care. By this summer, 26 states could move to ban abortion. According to Planned Parenthood, this would affect 36 million women. This is not the America that our founding fathers would have wanted. This is not what they fought and they died for. This is not the country I want her to inherit. Um, this is the land of the free. And half of our population is about to lose our freedom. While the march ended at the Hall of Justice, people here say the fight is far from over. Do not stop the fight. We are going to keep fighting. Ariana Cohen, CBS 8.